as I told to you, for an area developer, so what we have decided is, and what we have planned is that if you see that across for master licenses or such plans, any brand will ask for the entire maximum rollout plan, whereas we have worked on the minimum rollout plan, and they charge the money for for giving a master rights basis the maximum potential of that region, whereas we have worked in terms of the minimum rollout of that region. For an example, if somebody wants to take UP and Uttarakhand, we are talking about one of the training center which will be owned by that area developer, which will act as a regional office. Plus, we are only talking about 15 as a rollout for entire UP and Uttarakhand put together, right? And let me also tell you the economics. So, the unit franchise fees is only four lakhs plus GST, wherein we do an agreement for a period of five years. However, saying so for a unit area developer. So what for UP and Uttarakhand is the total collectible area developer fees. The total collectible franchise fees is 15 into 4 is for 60 lakhs. Am I right? But we are not charging 60 lakhs to give the area developer rights. We are just asking 40 percent of the franchise fees, and we will give you the area developer rights. So it means only by paying 24 lakhs plus GST and starting your own training center, somebody take can take the area developer rights for UP and Uttarakhand. Now. After taking the area developer rights, there are five benefits to my area developer. Point number one, as you can see in this el- entire illustration, that we are not charging any separate franchise fees for your own training center. Point number two, whenever a unit franchisee gets signed in a region, you get sixty percent of the franchise fees. It means out of four lakhs, two point four lakhs goes to my area developer. Point number three, for a student, we charge three kind of fees, which is registration fees. a uh, charges towards learning cloud and the tuition fees so out of that learning cloud charges there is a margin of 350 rupees per student per level to my area developer we charge a royalty of only 9% on tuition fees out of that 9% 3% goes to my direct english uk 3% remains with me as aptitude studios and 3% is shared with area developer so for the number of students that get studied across their region they get benefit of first a margin on the learning cloud second a margin on the royalty point number 4 a 5 that they get the benefit for their own training center for these two cost because they save for the number of students studying the charges towards the learning cloud of 350 rupees and they also get a benefit of 3% royalty on the students studying in their own training center i hope i am very clear on this 